Ladies and gentlemen, we welcome you here to a big night of fights. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside my ringside partner, Teddy Atlas. Looking forward to all the action today, and we're just about set for it. Boxing. Money's making his way to the ring now, and you can see how focused he is on the task at hand. Dynamite's coming to the ring with his entourage of cornermen. But they look calm, cool, and collected. Hard to believe that they're going to be firing off punches within moments. Introducing first, Mar Across the ring, Kid Dynamite. Okay, guys, we went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's touch gloves. Ten rounds slated in the books tonight. Here's the first. Scored well upstairs with the right hand. Good block. And now the ref gets involved and warns him for headbutting. Needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the headshot. He got hit, but he sends it right back. Money's rocked by a huge hook to the head. Good one, too, by Money. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. Kid Dynamite's missing the mark by a mile. That just was nowhere to be found. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Nice block by Money. He got hit flush, but then sent one back of his own. Teddy, I don't think he's got visions of sticking around too long. He's landed power punches early. Yeah, he wants to make it a quick night's work. Final 10 seconds of round number one. Little head hunting with the left. Come on. You're not winning the rounds, man. You're not winning the rounds. I need you to start with your jab and then go on and go to the body. Go to the body. I want you to chop down with your right to the body. He's timing you coming in. He's timing you. Kid Dynamite's bounces back in his step. Start of a new round coming off of a round in which he really took some punishment. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Hey, keep your hands up. An accurate left by Kid Dynamite. Left to the body. Takes one to give one. Uppercut in return. Committing now to the left hand. Good straight shot. It's all right. Nice block by Money. Good job with another left hand.
Halfway through round number two. Scored well with the left downstairs. Hit Dynamite's well off the mark that time. Keep it tight inside. Good step back, counter punch there. Beautiful. On the mark with a straight left hand. Blocks that punch. How about that left hand? well up top. Good block by Money. Keep working it, Jim. Sending out the power shot. It was a straight left hand. Good job. It was sudden. It was fast. It was direct by Kid Dynamite. Kid Dynamite's really working well. That last nice round, he was accurate. Now Look at the punch numbers. Okay. Now he's moving in with his head. You gotta breathe. Just breathe. Relax. How you feeling out there? Number three is underway. Money's in bad shape. Oh, and there you go. He is not meant for life on the outside there, and he just paid the price. He goes down. Because he didn't make his mind up. If you're not going to work out in front, get to a distance where you're safe. He stood there at a bad distance. No man's land. So he is able to get up to his feet after that knockdown. But, Teddy, it's what's ahead that's the problem. Yeah, we're getting a peek right now into his heart, into his soul. Kid Dynamite's nice. opponent nice. landing an effective counter punch right there. Money's movement's really helping him out, avoiding that punch. He is not in good shape. He could be on the deck in moments. Basic but beautiful. Jab, left hand. See, the defense pays off as he gets rid of that downstairs. What an impact that left hand just made by Money. Good flush shot upstairs. A little one-two. Jab followed by the cross. That's a big, big shot he just scored with. And why did he score? Because he created range, created distance, created a hole. And he filled that hole. Places that hook right to the body. And now you see the southpaw pulling the trigger with the straight left. Bring your hands up. Right? Come on, relax. Relax. Shake it out. Shake it out. You gotta relax. You gotta move out there, right? He has had this fight go exactly as he has wanted it to go early on. As we begin round number four, he's up three rounds to zip. The only thing you have to worry about is he hurt his opponent very easily early on. Does he now take for granted that he's going to do that anytime he wants and forget about the fundamentals, forget about the jab and the other things he knew he had to use coming into this fight? Good solid overhand left. Money's just coming out here hey, after being knocked down in the last round. Teddy, what are some of the things you look for 
that will tell you he's on steady ground and he looks fine. Well, the first thing I look for is the base, the foundation. I mean, you look at a house you want to see and you want to make sure that that basement is solid. There's cinder blocks there. You know, you don't want to see that upper floor waving a little when there's a wind. You're looking at his legs. You want to make sure that they're steady, they're firm. Kid Dynamite's doing well sticking to a game plan on the outside. Keep your hands up, keep your hands up. <laughs> Body shot, the left hand. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Kid Dynamite. Wow, a big flush blow, the left hand by Kid Dynamite. Kid Dynamite's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Off the target by Money. Uppercut! Uppercut! Hits him in the mug with the right. That's a fierce left hand that landed by Kid Dynamite. Kid Dynamite's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that stay offensive away assault. From the power hand, okay, keep circling away from that power. Hand. I need you to keep moving side to side, all right? So a fresh round is underway, but is it a fresh fighter? Kid Dynamite's corner is hoping so. Based on what we saw at the end of the last round, who knows? Well, his corner should also be hoping that his opponent across the way doesn't come out here like the executioner to get this over with, because if he does, I think it's over. Nice solid left hand scored by Kid Dynamite. And now you can see him doing some fine work here on the outside of his opponent. You know, and I see a terribly long, difficult night for his opponent because we already know he's going to win on the inside. That's his place. Now he's controlling things outside where it's not supposed to be his place. And now that backhand, the straight left hand, scores well for him. A stinging uppercut by Kid Dynamite. Solid left hand to the head. Look at that combination by Kid Dynamite. Kid Dynamite's way off the mark. That punch didn't have a chance. Money's on the bad end of a very impressive hook up top. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his own. Oh, uh, you see him with the left of the head there? Money's tagged. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Kid Dynamite. Solid shot, the overhand left. Money's inability to get away from his opponent's left hand is so evident. And it's going to stay that way if he doesn't change something. He needs to move the other direction, away from that punch. And round five comes to an end. One of his eyes is completely shut. They want this fight to continue on. They want to give themselves every chance they have to win it. What do they need to do? Well, what they need to do is be very calm in the corner, get pressure on that cut, get the right medicines in there, and maybe find a way to fool around in the corner somehow, dump some water, you know, in the corner where the referee has to spend a little bit more time cleaning it up. They want to get a little bit more seconds. Scored well with that straight left. Kid Dynamite just being smart on the outside. The left hand coming into play by Kid Dynamite. Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Kid Dynamite. 
Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Good exchange, he fires back. Yeah! How about a return to sender with the left hand? Money's completely missing the jab, and when that's not there, oh, you're gonna dug yourself a big hole. Now that's like saying I wanna go swimming. Guess what, there's no water. <laughs> you need water to swim. You need jab to fight, to set things up. Oh, a nice two-punch combo by Kid Dynamite. Ace yourself! Not able to land the headshot. Good job with the left hand. It was sudden, it was fast, it was direct by Money. And round six comes to an end. Now that he's back in the corner, we get a close-up look. All right. Money's cut, even what's worse. And it's up to the fighter now, Joe, for his attitude not to change. You know, we can look at it, and we can say, wow, that cut looks worse. The fans can look at it and say that. But the fighter must be steady. The same attitude as though he doesn't have a cut. Otherwise, he has no chance of winning this fight. Targeting that straight left hand. Get down. What a big shot. Wow, is this good stuff. What good stuff. He just scored the knockdown after being knocked down earlier. Joe, that's incredible. And the knockdown earlier actually set up this knockdown because his opponent, he got a little reckless, a little careless. Come on, man. Get up to your feet. And somehow, someway, he's going to continue on here. And if he's going to stay in this fight, now he's got to avoid this opponent like the Black Plague. He missed that uppercut. Kid Dynamite's got a little something coming back at him. A counterpunch score. Good smooth work by Money. That's classic counterpunching. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, gave him the left shoulder, and then gave him the right hand. He missed with that headshot. Fine fundamentals, good counterpunch. Boy, unable to get away from those punches. If there was a baseball umpire around, he'd call that a strikeout by Kid Dynamite. Blocking a score. Three minutes gone by in this round. No doubt about it. Teddy's scorecard has this in only one direction as we begin round number eight. Kid Dynamite's been in prime form. He's damaged his opponent badly. Exactly, Joe. If it keeps up, you got to wonder when the corner is going to step in there and stop it. Do that again. Good return good. fire Do that, that time. time. He took a shot. Now he gives a left. Kid Dynamite's doing exactly what he's always done stylistically, Teddy. Now, he was knocked down early, so what he always does got him in this position. Yeah, he understands his identity. He understands that, you know, he's going to win or lose the man that he is, the fighter that he is. He just has to make sure that he makes a few adaptations. Well-targeted left hand by Kid Dynamite. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. Money's bang 
by a left hand. Reese. Solid. And for the second time tonight, he goes down. So now the question becomes, after that knockdown, and he has gotten up, how does he survive? Joe, one of the ways he survives is if he's been taught, have good habits, have good fundamentals been put there. You're going to find out right now, he needs them right now. Able to dismiss that body shot. Good flush, straight left hand. And round eight comes to an end. Real good. Let me paint this picture for you. You got to figure out a strategy, and your fighter's down to one eye. I hope that he read some history books. Or he watched a movie named 300. You saw that movie, oh, yeah. didn't you? Great movie about the Spartans where they were outnumbered, and they had to get the terrain right to fight the fight. They had to get into the mountains where the greater forces, the great army, could not be the great army. They could not get in there and battle where they could take advantage of their superior forces. That's what he's got to do. He's got to move the fight into a part, a portion of the ring where he will not be vulnerable on that side. Able to get away from that headshot with the block. Money's doing what happens to many who have been hurt. And he was stunned in this fight earlier. And you can see him almost wishing he could put a protective shell around himself. He's just all about the defense right now. Yeah, well, right now it's got to be all about him trying to be Tom Cruise. He's got to be an act. He's got to look for an Academy Award and stop doing that. If we can see that, his opponent can see that. He has to con his opponent, not let him know that this is what he's feeling. Zoning in with the overhand left. Kid Dynamite's doing well here with that two-punch combination. Smart punch right there. The uppercut worked. Yeah, That's like a good I left see. hand by I Kid Dynamite. I see, baby. Left to the body. Kid Dynamite's proving to be elusive. with a straight left. Good flush shot by Money. The end of round nine. You can have the best game plan in the world, but when your eye shuts closed like that, everything changes. The one thing doesn't change, Joe, and that's the mentality of a warrior. You find a way. You do not give in. You find a way. You concentrate harder, and you see with that one. Kid Dynamite's been stunned. Did you see that? And he crashes to the canvas once again. He's gotten up before. What about this time? Get up, man! Five, six, seven. Get up! Down he goes, now up he gets. And if he wants to stay up, he he's gonna have done. to grab on. Kill a little time. Gets rid of that effort. Targeting a left hand to the body. Good biting, snapping shot by Money. He gets off with a combination up top. Kid Dynamite's doing a really nice job here. I mean, putting his punches together. This is what you're supposed to look like as an offensive fighter. Yes, it is, especially when you have a guy in front of you putting the earmuffs on. You know, you cover up the way that his opponent is. You're supposed to put him... Oh! And banging away he goes. Knocked down 
again. Unreal. Now you gotta wonder what the corner's thinking. Are they gonna stop this? Get up, One, damn it! Two, three, four. Stand, five, stand, stand! Six, seven. Focus. So he goes down, but able to get up to his feet. Teddy, what should he be thinking about now? Well, right now, just surviving, but. If he survives, then he better figure out why he was put on the floor. Pace yourself. Hey, Good hey, combination hey. on the one-two by Kid Dynamite. <laughs> Trying to time that straight left hand, and he does so with ease. Hey. Good job. It was sudden. It was fast. It was direct by Money. Final bell of what was a one-sided outing. Well, this one is easy to score. At least it should be. Let's hear how the judges had it. You send it up to the ring. So a unanimous decision win by Kid Dynamite. That's the way we saw it all night long. The judges agree. It was hard to see it any other way. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore saying thanks for being with us.